Hi, welcome to my channel, Charvenic Renee. I'm Renee and I'm so excited that you're here. We're celebrating 500 subscribers, yay! <laughs> I appreciate you so much. I'm also marking a special occasion with my first PR video from Merit Beauty. Merit Beauty is founded by Catherine Power and it was launched last year in January 2021. This year they are releasing a new line of lipsticks, the Signature Lip Lightweight Lipstick Collection. The collection is available in eight shades and I have two of them to show you along with some other products from Merit Beauty. Let's start. Okay, so I went ahead and I just took these items out of the box that came. And the box, since it is a clean beauty brand, the shipping box is 100% recyclable, reusable, and it can also be used for compost. This is the card that was included in the box, Merit Minimalist Beauty the antidote to the oversaturated world of beauty. Look at this cute little cosmetic bag. I think that when you order directly from the website, every first order will receive this bag. This is really cute. I don't know, something about it makes me think of Winnie the Pooh. <laughs> I don't know why. All right, so these are the items. And thank you so much, Merit Beauty, for reaching out to me. So the first thing we're gonna do is start with the lipsticks, the new lipsticks, the Signature Lip. The two shades I chose are Fashion, which is a soft berry, and Cabo, which is a soft orange red. There are eight shades in the collection. I have two. They retail for $26. They are clean, vegan, and cruelty-free. This is such a pretty case. I was not expecting this. There's the color, Cabo Signature Lip Lightweight Lipstick. It's supposed to be a light, sheer type of lipstick with a satin finish, but also has the qualities of a lip balm. This is a very pretty color. The packaging is also made of 30% recycled plastic, but it feels nice, you know? So I'm kind of surprised. It's not flimsy. Let's do the first swatch. You can see the sheerness and it looks moisturizing just on my arm. It has squalene and sunflower seed oil to provide long lasting moisture, papaya extract to soothe the lips and raspberry oil to moisturize and add a light scent. Let me see. Oh, I do. Yeah, it's very light. It's, it's a pleasant scent, I like it. And this is the shade Fashion. Another interesting thing about this brand is that the formula is EU compliant. So it's free from over 1400 potentially unsafe ingredients. Now this brand is new to me. I haven't heard of Merit Beauty until they reached, oh, look how you guys know how I am over a berry lipstick. But as I was saying, Merit Beauty is a new brand to me. I did not hear of them until they reached out to me uh, for PR. That is a beautiful berry. Yeah, I'm liking this. The Signature Lip Lipsticks retail for $26. And I have a personalized affiliate link that you can use 
to place an order. I will have it listed in the description box and I will also include it as a pinned comment. If you're looking to purchase from the collection, I would so appreciate your support. Let's take a look at the other items that I received. There's something in particular I'm really curious about. Yeah, this is it. This is called the Minimalist Perfecting Complexion Stick. I got the shade Sepia, which is deep with yellow undertones. Now, I do not wear foundation or concealer or anything like that. Not for any particular reason. I just, when I started wearing makeup, I am a late bloomer. I did not start wearing makeup until my mid thirties. <laughs> I just never got around to dealing with foundation. It just seems like it was so much and so many shades and matching and all that, that I just hadn't gotten around to dealing with it. But there are times where my skin can stand to use a bit more evening out. So that is what this is supposed to do. Hold on, I'm getting a little confused. There we go. Oh, oh dear. Oh, why do I always have trouble? Okay, well, there you go. Back in the tube. <laughs> that was a small amount. Let me see. Nope, I guess this is it. This is all the product. But it's not meant to be an all-over application. It's, it's basically like a spot treatment where you have troubled areas and you just kind of want to hide those or make it your skin look more even. But I took a guess on if this was the shade for me. And it actually seems darker than my skin tone. So they did have other shades to choose from on the website, but they were already sold out. So I went with this one because it was still available. But it says on the website that this can also be used as a contour. I don't really contour. Um, but if you're interested, it could work. The complexion stick is $38. Now, I'm gonna be honest here. I feel like this tube is a bit bulky for what it is. It could probably be a slimmer packaging. It also seems, yeah not a huge amount of product but i don't know uh let me see if i can open the other end yeah i think i messed this up i probably um I probably twisted it too much. Yeah. Yeah, see, it's going down. So yeah, I opened it at the wrong, or attempted to open it at the wrong end, but I'm still gonna, I'm still gonna play with it and try it out. The next item is the Day Glow Highlighting Balm. This comes in two shades. I chose, does it say? I chose Bounce, which is a rose gold. It is a, okay, now I don't wanna <laughs> mess this up <laughs> like I did the, uh, the complexion stick. So, okay, since this has the name, this must be the bottom, so this must be the top. There we go. I don't know why I seem to have so many packaging malfunctions, but this is real life. I'm 
clumsy in real life so this is what happens and so I'm going to record it but this is the I'm twisting it to see yes it is going up higher okay so this is the highlighter and it is a cream balmy highlighter it's supposed to be dewy with no sparkle and it is $30 I'm curious about this now get in focus there we go powder products or at least for highlighter blush they are my preference but I can appreciate a cream product especially when the weather gets warmer in my area it gets really humid when summertime rolls around and so a cream product is usually really nice to wear because you don't have to worry about it moving and it's light on the skin also if you work out a cream product is nice to use if you don't just want to be barefaced you know in the gym or anything I can see the rose gold I it's definitely more pink than I was expecting it to be I thought it would be a bit more brown but yeah these two items are the flush balm cheek color I chose two shades there are five altogether and I chose what looked to be the two deepest on the website raspberry beret and mood <laughs> shout out to the prince reference right there <laughs> the blush is $28 raspberry beret is a deep berry I'm gonna go ahead Ooh, look at that I'm gonna go ahead and open the other one mood is a soft burgundy so this is what they look like okay so it is a twist off And like I said, is it a cream blush? It is so pretty. That was Raspberry Beret, and this one is Mood. Wow. Just looking at them, at least with the caps on, I thought they were going to be very similar, but they actually are not, which is great. I rearranged it just to make it neater. And this is the last product, the Shade Slick tinted lip oil I chose the shade Cara Cara this is not necessarily supposed to be a lip gloss because I'm not much of a gloss person it's more as it says like a tinted lip oil so a liquid lip balm gosh this is such a gorgeous color let's see So there's the wand. I'll put that right next to the new lipstick. That's actually a nice pairing right there. So Cabo lipstick with Cara Cara lip oil. I can see that working together very nicely. 
The Shade Stick Oil is $24. It contains rosehip oil, shea butter, grapeseed, and jojoba oils, which is perfect for me because I always suffer from dry lips and I always need something no matter what time of year it is to help me. So this is really nice. Here is another look at all the products I received. This is the Kara Kara Lip Oil, Cabo Lipstick, Fashion Lipstick, Bounce Highlighter, Sepia Complexion Stick, Raspberry Beret Flush Balm, and Mood Flush Balm. I love the colors that I chose. I think this will create a really pretty look and make sure now that I have 500 subscribers, I now have a community tab and I will do a look using all of these products that I will post on the community tab. And I will also post on my Instagram at Charvenique Renee. So make sure that you're following, but these are very pretty colors. The only thing I'm questioning is the complexion stick. Um, but like I said, I will play with it again. If you're interested in any item from this collection, especially the newly launched signature lip lipsticks, I have my affiliate link posted and I would appreciate it so much if you used it. If you enjoyed the video, please like comment, subscribe, Ring the notification bell so that you know when a new video uploads. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much for your support. We reached 500 subscribers. Thank you, Merit Beauty, for reaching out to me. I appreciate it so much. Thanks so much for watching. Bye.